Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you how to build a fun guy tree farm. This design was inspired by Cupfan 135's design on Hermitcraft, but I have made some improvements. So what we need to do is we need to stand on this pressure plate and right click this lock. Then once the tree grows the nylium retract, so this log just destroyed the nylium into another rack. Then we can use an axe to remove the wood. Then we go outside and we can see that there's the warts here. So we can press this button which activates our TNT duper's which will fall and blow up the warts. And once we finished destroying all the warts then we can come back here and farm more wood. For this farm you will need lots of blocks, two chests, lots of obsidian, around 105 ender chests, 105 hoppers, 17 redstone torches, one dispenser, one repeater, one pressure plate, one nylon block, one button, six sticky pistons, 24 slime blocks, four detector rails, four walls, four dead coral fans, four mine carts, two observers, 16 redstone dust, a lot of fungus, a lot of bone meal, and a 12 by 15 area. So first we count out 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, off to the side, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, onto the back, and then place a block here, the sticky piston here, with nylium on top of it. Then you will temporarily place a block here, to power the piston, and place two blocks like this with the torch and the repeater here then on the other side they go two blocks with dust and dust and to a torch then this torch that go here into a block with the torch then we can break our temporary block over here and place dust like this into a redstone torch here so now whenever there's a block over here the piston will attract now we're going to make the floor over here and place a black stone pressure plate over here or it could be any pressure plate then you place a sticky piston here with an observer facing upwards then over here we place an observer facing up and downwards and we get our dispenser and we place it temporary block there and there here now our observer should be here so that way when this extends this will power the dispenser to block over there so now whenever we stand on this block anything in the dispenser should get shot out or actually first you place two blocks here to dust over here. Now, stand here, the dispenser should shoot out items. And then, whenever something is over here, the block retracts. Now, we place an obsidian block on top of the sort stone dust and go to new and high. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and then our 21st block would go here, but we'll put that in later. Now we make it so that all other sides are the same height.
want to show you on the skippable so then when you're here you could still get up you could still step up over here into the nylium so take the tree down and then you can make this go 20 blocks okay so now we go five back from the blackstone pressure plate so one two three four five then we go three up so one two three then we get our chests and put them over here then we take out the box underneath them then we stand here then we put blocks behind it so one hoppers behind it we count one two three four five hoppers and you should reach the obsidian then we're going to go around now we're going to reach here and you go from back five hoppers so one two three four five then round this and we're gonna go one two three four five and around one two three four five and then we can go around Now we just need to go to the edges and make diagonals from these sides, like this. The toppers. So this should all be clean. So just add an extra hopper here. So it's supposed to be one, two, three, four, five. And you just find the ones on the inside. Then we go off to the sides and they should meet up if we did everything right. Good. So this way, after the wart blocks land on the ender chest, they'll be picked up by these hoppers and put into the chests. And last side now. So there we are. Now we need to take our ender chests and put ender chests on top of all the hoppers. Now we need to do the TNT duper. So you place a sticky piston here, slime box one, two, three wall off its face then you go off to the side and one two three then you place a dead coral fan here with the TNT here you place a detector rail here with a minecart on top now we repeat that for all four sides okay now we begin the torch tower so we're going to be using 14 torches so we place the button there and count up torches so one Two, and 14 then we use just like this and we make it go down like that then we press the dust all the way across now on the sign box now when we press the button the TNT duper should activate. Ok, 
Okay, now that they're ready, now they're all activated. Now you also want to use an obsidian wall to protect your torches like this. So you're just going to build obsidian all the way up to the top. This is to prevent your torches from being destroyed. And that should be our farm done. And that is our fungus farm done. Now we can try it out. So we stand here, we bone build this. Now we can remove the tree. Now we see that there's the leaves. Now the work should get blown up. And with a few TNTs, they'll get blown up. And that is our fungus farm done. If you like this tutorial, please like it, the video. And if you really liked it, please subscribe. If you have any ideas about what I should build next, please comment down below. And I will see you next time.